the rankings of these teams are pretty well matched. Let's see what happens here during autonomous Red Alliance and Blue Alliance, both with cargo in. Red Alliance into the high hub with two. Blue Alliance into the low hub with one. Red Alliance 12, Blue Alliance eight as we come to the end of Autonomous. Red Alliance with three cargo into their hub, into the hub, credited to their account. These robots are busy running around right now trying to pick up those car cargo. The um, the Red Alliance getting one, two, three, four. Just keep going into that high hub. The Red Alliance score climbing to 22 to eight. And in and out of that high hub, we see that so often here. If you can make it stick in the high hub, it's a good thing, but so many of them bounce in and then out without scoring. The score 24 red, nine blue as we come down to 77 seconds left in match number 60 of 66. 70 seconds left, can the Red Alliance get that cargo bonus? Not unless more of that cargo sticks in the high hub. There's another two into the high hub by the Red Alliance. 26 red, 11 blue. We're down now to 50 seconds left in this match. And out on the field, we see some robots thinking about what they're gonna do and some robots not moving. 6350, the claw bots motionless on the field. 3268 pushing around Blue Alliance. And breaking up the play there at the hub. Score hasn't changed much as a result of all that defensive play. It's 28 to 14 as we come down to 10 seconds left in the match. On the Red Alliance hangar zone, we see the Saints Robotics climbing on the mid hub. On the blue hangar zone, we have 80, 32. That's Redshift climbing on the mid hub. We'll be back with a final score in a moment. And here is that final score. The Red Alliance wins qualification match number 60. You can see that most of that was due to the cargo. Two ranking points for the win, no bonus or ranking points in that match.